Dexcom's product has been designed from the very beginning, particularly our G6 system, to fit right into the telehealth infrastructure. When a patient uses our system and that data is displayed on a patient's phone, that data is also going to Dexcom servers. Those servers then feed a professional system we have called Clarity to whereby physicians can call up a patient's data. So when a Dexcom patient needs to talk with their physician, their physician literally can sit at their computer screen with no interaction from the patient and pull that data up. Prior to the COVID crisis and, and prior to what's going on now with physicians' offices, we had a three-hour delay on that data. We dropped that delay. Uh, we tried to make our clarity system much closer to real time. And so literally, if you had an appointment with your physician right now and you're wearing a Dexcom, they could look at your CGM data on the screen and speak with you with no other interaction. And what we have learned is remarkable results from this. A physician's been very interested. They're able to take care of their patients in a very professional manner. In fact, some of them who have been familiar with CGM for more than a decade have reached out and said, this is amazing. We can actually see what's going on with our patients remotely, and it's working very well. Another great use case for telehealth that we've seen is for newly diagnosed patients. If you've just been diagnosed with diabetes and you don't know what to do and you need to go see a doctor, imagine how much more effective it is to put on a Dexcom CGM and you as a patient can see what's going on real time in your life, but the physician can then coach you uh, numerous times throughout the course of that startup phase without you having to come into the office. So we've seen a very, very big impact of our device in telehealth, and we're doing everything we can to make that experience better. Well, I think we've learned a lot uh, during this situation with respect to the importance of glucose control and glucose variability. Uh, as patients have had to go into the hospital, uh, our system has been granted use in the hospital in the U.S. We have learned very much that if we can get the diabetes patients' glucose under control, the other systems are much easier to manage. And the efficiency of CGM in that environment as far as nursing and physician time has proved to be outstanding. Uh, it's also outstanding for, for patients, I mean, for the safety of the caregivers. They don't have to go in the room and see a patient every time as our system is able to remotely monitor uh, patients that are there. I, and again, in the type 1 population, better glucose control and telehealth. Uh, physicians will be able to better act with their patients. I, I, I think this will do nothing but expand the use of CGM over time because we need these type of outcomes to take care of people. We have a, a number of presentations going on that are Dexcom related or with our Dexcom partners. One of our studies is one in type two diabetes patients who are using insulin. And we see results very consistent with what we've seen uh, in other studies we've done with a very significant A1C drop in these patients. Uh, in just 12 weeks of CGM wear. We have other studies coming on automated insulin delivery systems with our insulin pump partners where we show the time and range for these patients goes up significantly and time and range is that amount of time during the course of a day that your blood glucose values are within the range of a normal individual and, and, and you're not too low or too high. So we'll see very good data there. Mainly at ADA, what we're seeing now is that CGM drives everything. Any study that's presented on drugs, on insulin delivery, on, on these automated insulin de delivery systems, they're all measured by use of CGM. And, and we've come a very long way there. We have such a bright future. Uh, our runway gets bigger and longer each and every day. As our goals, as we look forward to the future, we want to become the primary glucose measurement device for people intensively managing insulin. And we're well on the way to that with our current product, G6, uh, which is a market leader in our technology pipeline. We're looking at expanding geographically, uh, getting bigger, increasing access uh, in other markets. Uh, reimbursement in the UK is, is beginning to increase. Uh, it's getting better there, but we really need to get into all the other geographies. I think also over time, you will see Dexcom CGM become the primary tool in managing type 2 diabetes as well. 
as these patients are given data to better manage their medicine, their diet, their exercise. And then you add the telehealth component and the ability to get data to these physicians who are taking care of these people. They can combine the glucose data with the other key healthcare measures such as blood pressure and, 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 and the lab work, get a much better picture and profile of these type 2 patients, again, leading to better outcomes and overall reduced costs in the system. So our future is extremely bright, and we are looking forward to continuing to serve the diabetes and then other markets.